Alrighty, so this is the system we have uh, in my garage. Um, starting off, we have a Fire MBG 12LX. Yeah, pretty standard, not too hard to find. Um, of it, we have a Federal Signal. I forgot the model number, but it's one of these alarms. Um, and then coming over to here, a Simplex uh, 2999754. Do have a 2999139, which is a metal tool action version. And then above it, we have a P2R with a blue strobe. Now this is not glued on or anything, it just kind of sits there. It does have a white back box. Um, but as you see, this right here is what we're sitting on those. Um, as you see, that's where I got the blue strobe from 7L series. So that's pretty cool. All right, well, I think I should pull something. So I do have a pre-signal. So, um, I guess we'll start off pulling this. All right, three, two, one, push and fold down. It does take a little bit. Oh, it's taking quite a while. There we go. There's that, so, yeah. Um, I guess we can now pull this down and I believe it will just immediately sound. So there we go. So, I guess what we can do now is set this stuff so. Take this key from here. Set this pulse station with the cable gun. As you see, uh, you can actually just pull this straight down. Because the older uh, pulse stations, uh, there's a little tab that goes right here. So it falls out, you can easily just pull that. So as you see, there should be something right behind there, but fell out. So it's not there. But. There's that, and inside the panel, we have Simplex B key. Okay, it's a 2999-9139. You know, pretty standard. I really want to get a dual action version. So, I guess now that they're reset, we can go ahead and do a system reset. Alrighty, well, I think that will conclude our test for the day. So, have a great day.